Hello folks, uh, this is a 2018 Mason paper 1-2 and the question number is 17. It's concerned with uh, uh, equilibrium. Uh, we can apply vectors also here. So it says that uh, the diagram shows a ball of weight W. So this is the ball, this is the weight hanging in equilibrium from a string. This is the string. The string is at an angle theta with the vertical. So this angle is theta. In other words, I can also say that uh, if I draw a vertical line here, <coughs> this angle is also theta. The tension in the string is uh, T. So this is the tension force in the string. The ball is held away from the wall by a horizontal force P from a metal rod. So this is a rod and it applies a certain force here in this direction. So now we have to find the uh, relationship between the magnitudes of T, this P and this W. So let us first uh, remember that when there is equilibrium, uh, the forces in all dimensions are equal. For example, the horizontal forces in the opposite side should be equal. The vertical forces in the opposite side should be equal. So let's go for the uh, vertical force here. Uh, the vertical force in this direction, in this direction, in this direction will be equal to component of this T in this direction. That's equal to T, since theta is here, it is cos of theta. So, since there are no other vertical forces, what we must have is, and since the body is in equilibrium, we must have, we must have T cos of theta is equal to W. T cos theta equal to W. So, if you go through here, uh, choice D has this thing, W T cos theta, but we still have to solve for this thing. Let's see. Now, similarly, uh, the component of this T in the, in the left, to the left will be equal to, it is T sine of theta. Now, since the system is in equilibrium, we must have this T sine theta should be equal to this P. So, <coughs> so if uh, uh, I do some mathematics here, if I divide this equation by this, I will have T sine theta by T cos of theta will be equal to P by W. So T and T gone, we have uh, tan theta is equal to P by W, or I can say W tan of theta is equal to P. As uh, previously stated, we already have this condition. Let us see if this condition is there. But this is not true here because we have P equal to W tan theta, and here we have W equal to P tan theta. And similarly, uh, none of other conditions also right now apply here now what we now do is let us square this thing and this thing so it gives us t square cos square theta equal to w square and the t square sine square theta is equal to p square if i add both of these things i will have t square cos square theta plus t square sine square theta is equal to w square plus p square which gives me t square common cos square theta plus a sine square theta is equal to w square plus p square which further gives me t square equal to w square plus p square so uh, which means that uh, we have uh, this thing uh, this uh, cos square theta is equal to 1 it gives t square equal to w square plus p square so if you go through here this is choice number C gives us this value and all other lessons are not true in this case.